Here we have a 2019 BMW X3 X-Drive 20D M Sport. Now this vehicle comes with the 19 inch black alloy wheels, all in excellent condition and unmarked. We also have the black sapphire metallic paintwork. We have the LED daytime running headlights, the glass black front grills. We also have the glass black front splitter as well. Round to the passenger side, you find we have the second alloy wheel, again in excellent condition. We also have the colour-coded door handles and door mirrors, with the black trim around the windows with the privacy glass as well for the rear passengers. Up top, you find we have the black roof rails, we also have the shark fin antennae and the rear spoiler as well. We also have front and rear parking sensors with a visual display inside and a reversing camera as well. We have the dual exit exhaust and also a power assisted tailgate which will open if you press this button just here on the remote. Now inside of here you find that we have plenty of space for whatever you may need. We have the partial shelf which we can pull back just like so. And as you can see there's a large amount of space inside of here. We also have the 12 volt connectivity on the right hand side. If you press this button just up here then you find it will close just like so. And then walking back around to the driver's side, you find this vehicle is free from any major marks, dents or scratches. So taking a look at the interior. Inside of the back first, you find we have the full leather interior. We have the foldable armrests in the centre, the fixed ISO points as well. You may have noticed the ambient lighting just there on the doors. We have the climate control for the rear passengers. We also have the electric windows as well on the doors. Taking a look at the front, again the full leather interior. Both these front seats are heated and there is a look at them. Again on the doors, the electric windows. We also have the electric power forward and mirrors as well. We have the auto lights and the auto wipers. We have a multifunctional steering wheel, paddle shifters on either side. If we take a seat inside, you'll find we have the cruise control and also the speed limiter as well. We have a digital dashboard up top. If you put our foot on the brake, press the start button, then the vehicle will start up for us. And you'll find we'll be free from any warning lights, the only one being fully fuel so nothing to worry about. Now we can change the look of the dashboard by going into different drive modes. We're currently in the comfort drive mode. If we go into the Eco Pro, you find the dials change just like so. Same if you put it into sport, it will change to red for a more sporty look. Moving across onto the center console, you find the main infotainment screen. So on here, you find the likes of the sat nav. We also have a range of media as well, such as the radio. We have the Bluetooth audio as well. We also have the phone connectivity just there. If we go to the main menu, you'll find that we have the apps. So if you click onto there, you find we have Android Auto, Apple CarPlay, and we also have all these other installed apps as well. Go back onto the main menu, go onto Car. This is where you find that we have the interior ambient lighting with a few colors to choose from just here, as you can see. If we go back again, go onto the driving information. This is where you find the exit view. We also have the sport displays as well, which is a pretty cool feature to have. Of course, we have the different drive modes. We have Eco Pro, we have Comfort and also Sport. We have the intelligent safety as well just there, making the car a very safe car to drive. Putting the car into reverse, you find we have the reversing camera. We also have the front and rear parking sensors as well as the park assist. Put it back into park mode, moving further down, we have the climate control. We also have the heated seats on either side, working just as they should do, as you can see. Ice cold air conditioning as well. We also have some storage space just inside of here. We have two good sized cup holders, 12 volt connectivity, and also a USB port. The different drive mode buttons, we have the parking sensors, the hill descent control as well. Electric handbrake, auto hold. We also have all the shortcuts just here for the infotainment screen. Nice little leather armrest which can be opened up for more storage. Inside of there you find we have a Type-C USB port. Well that's all that we're going to show you guys today. If you want to find out more then please check out the website. This vehicle comes with a fresh service, fresh MOT, HBI clear, competitive finance deals and free nationwide next day delivery. Thank you for watching. Video test drive of this 2019 BMW X3 X Drive 20 M Sport. Now, the purpose of this video test drive today is to show that the vehicle drives exactly how you'd expect it to. Now, as you can see, I'm not going to fight with steering wheel two keepers in a straight line, it's going straight into not the up to the left or to the right hand side. We have a multifunction steering wheel paddle shift if we stay in the county manual mode, and on the left hand side, you have a cruise control and speed limiter. We have your digital dash in front of you, which changes when you go through your different drive mode. The screen up here where you can find your satellite navigation, your Bluetooth media, Bluetooth audio connectivity. Go down to apps, you can find Apple CarPlay and Android Auto there as well. Front of air parking sensors and also a rear reversing camera. We have ambient lighting in this vehicle. We have your BMW individual trim, match with your glass black trim down there. It makes it a very nice environment to be in. 
We have a very comfortable full leather seat with the extended fire support. Both front seats are also heated, so for those winter mornings, it's perfect. Now that they're very comfortable, you can quite easily do two, three, even four miles in this vehicle and still get out feeling fresh. So right now I'm coming up to the industrial state where I'm going to take a right. I will be following a very stop, then I'll pop it straight into the reverse, just show you the brakes work exactly how you'd expect them to. And you'll see pop up on the centre screen of the rear reversing camera. So just pulling up to it now, and I'll do a countdown from three. So pulling in now, and then you stop in three, two, one, park, and see brakes straight into reverse, and no issues whatsoever. Front and rear parking sensors, rear camera just there. Back into drive again, no issues whatsoever. Now, if you've answered all of your questions and the cries during this test drive and walk on video, please feel free to get in contact with the sales team where they can answer and answer questions and also run through some cars with you. But that's it for me, and it's walk on. We're doing a test drive, it's it for me soon. Cheers.